Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Delena and you are watching Brown Girl Lux. If you have not already, please consider subscribing to my channel and turning on that notification bell so you do not miss any of my uploads. Today we are getting into the five best luxury handbags for fall. So if you are interested, keep on watching. you all will be surprised to know that this video is only including a one black handbag. Now y'all know I love a good black handbag. However, I know most people really enjoy neutral handbags, browns, the nudes, those type of colors during the fall season. So that is what I'm really going to focus on today. Some of these bags are not my most used handbags. However, to me they make a great bag for the fall season. Obviously, you can carry these bags year round, so don't feel as though because I'm recommending them for fall, you can't carry them any other season because all of these bags I am sharing today, I will carry no matter the time of the year. However, I think I would just happen to grab them a little bit more for the fall season. The bag I want to go ahead and start out with is one of my least used handbags, however, I know a lot of folks love this bag. This bag is a go-to. And this particular style handbag, in my opinion, is a great bag for the fall season. The bag I'm speaking of is my Louis Vuitton Neverfull. This is in the Damiera bin. And y'all, this is in the MM size as well. Now, I do have the pink interior version. I do have an organizer inside gonna bring it up close so you all can see just the detail I do have my first and middle initials on my bag I got this bag from my husband um, as our first year of Christmas together obviously we weren't married so I knew in my heart eventually we would be but <laughs> I didn't want to put my DO initial on there because obviously we weren't married yet however that's why I went with my middle initial versus my um, maiden last name Y'all, I think this bag is great for fall. First off, this bag can carry a ton of different things. So the Louis Vuitton Neverfull is a bag that I feel like most women are going to want to grab when they're on the go, going to work, you know, going out for a day out. Maybe you have a small child and you don't want to carry a diaper bag. Maybe they're a little bit older. You don't need a diaper bag per se, but you need to have room to store all of their items. The Neverfull is going to be a great option for you. I wore this bag... I think once this spring and I mean I really really loved it um I wish I had got the PM size I think that would have been a little bit more suitable for my needs and how I just prefer small handbags but I know the girls are gonna be bringing this bag out this fall because I mean again it's brown you can wear this with any and everything you could dress this bag up you can dress it down so to me when you're thinking about a good fall handbag, especially if this is like your first luxury handbag, you need to go with something that can be dressed up or dressed down, especially if you're that type of person. If you're a woman who just always dresses down, no worries, or you always dress up, then maybe a dressier handbag is best for you. However, in my opinion, the Neverfull is going to be a great option to have in your collection it's going to be easy to wear and again you can just throw your stuff in there i prefer the more like structured look versus like that droop which is why i do have it um in the uh, the organizer inside of this bag that's the reason why i chose to do the organizer because me personally y'all i don't like the droopy effect but overall great option a least used handbag but that doesn't mean i don't love this bag it's just not always suitable for the places i'm going because in most cases i want something kind of lightweight and out the way a nice mini bag is gonna work for me now a mini bag for me that's going to be perfect for this fall. It's another bag from Louis Vuitton. And to me, this is going to work for most occasions as well. Obviously not any super dressy occasions. But most other occasions, casual lunch dates, casual brunch, running to the mall, running errands. The Louis Vuitton Palm Springs mini bag will work for you. I've had this bag now going on, what, three years I love this. Again, this bag is currently stuffed because this is my everyday handbag. I carry this bag year round. The reason why I'm saying it looks cool for fall is because I think it'll look nice with a pair of like sweats 
and um, a sweatshirt, a hoodie. Um, it'll look good with jeans, a nice button down blouse like I'm wearing today. This bag will work very, very well for you. It's very useful. Now, the price increase that recently came with this bag, I'm definitely side-eyeing Louis Vuitton, but I will say, this bag kind of went a little while without getting any kind of noticeable increases. So going from like 1990 to 2300 definitely seems like a huge jump. But then when I think about the fact that this one skipped a lot of those price increases they did last year, so I don't know if they're trying to make up for it. I don't know what their intentions are with that, but I do know that this one kind of stayed at that same price point for a while. So if you missed out, Again, I'm telling you now, if it's an item you want, a luxury item, and you catch it, number one, get it because you may not catch it again, and number two, get it because there may be a price increase. Nobody wants to pay $310 more for this now. You know, it's the same bag. It's the same quality. Why am I paying more? Because of the demand. So, again, if you love this bag, I'm here to say it's a great piece. I have several videos on my channel. So today, as I'm talking through these bags, you may hear some things I've already shared. Or you may think I want a little bit more detail. Go check out those reviews because that is going to get into a little bit more detail about each specific bag. But yes, the Louis Vuitton Mini Palm Springs bag is going to work for you all fall season long. So the next bag that I do want to mention is one I mentioned in my fall fashion affordable and luxury fashion video. I'll make sure I link that because if you haven't checked that out, that's me giving you a few like fashion tips for fall things that I'll be wearing things or pieces that you may need to grab for your collection this season. So I did share this bag and this is my only black handbag I'm sharing today. This is my YSL medium Lulu the gold hardware it's that bronze gold i love this bag this is another least used handbag in my collection however during the fall season i love to grab this bag because i don't know if it's just me but i find myself carrying more things in the fall winter months um in the summer it's like i just want to be super minimal i guess because it's hot I don't want to be dealing with a big old handbag in 90 degree weather. Maybe that's what it is. But in the fall season, I do find myself stuffing some of my mini bags to capacity. So the medium Lulu would be the better option for me. Now this bag you can dress up or you can dress down. I always say the bronze gold hardware gives me dress down vibes. Um, that does not mean I can't put a dress on with this. It just means that it gives me more dress down versus like the shiny gold hardware on my medium envelope bag. If you all want to see more details on this bag, there's a comparison video on my channel between this bag and the medium envelope and you'll be able to hear more details. But this fall season, this is going to be a go-to for me. I love it. I love the size overall because to me, there's a time and a place for this size bag. And there's also a time and a place for my mini bags. This bag makes complete sense for me during this time of the year. And I know for a fact you all will be seeing it, gracing my Instagram because I'm gonna be pulling for it. So the last two bags I'll be talking about are coming in from Gucci. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and start with the one that's not used much, however, I imagine I'm gonna use this a lot more this fall winter season. The bag I'm speaking of is my Gucci Marmont bag in the small size. This is an, in that nude color. Now, the reason I'm saying I'm probably gonna use this a lot more this fall is because I do wanna get into vlogging a little bit more. I do wanna get into um, you know, taking you guys along with me when I'm shopping and doing things because I do know that a lot of folks love those. I also want to get in the practice because Vlogmas is not too far away. So I need to kind of start wrapping my head around that and that means I need to be taking my camera with me everywhere I go. Obviously some places I will not be using my camera. It'll be easier to use my phone because some places won't let you film. So if I'm trying to get a quick little clip it's easier to use my phone. But my mini bags don't fit my camera and my camera is obviously very, very compact. However, my mini bags are just too small for them. So I need a good bag that's gonna work this fall that'll go with a lot of my neutral pieces. And that's just another thing I wanna call out. I know the girls are loving neutral for this fall. This particular handbag can be worn with anything. This is a great color. It's like a, like a dusty, 
dusty mauve type of color this is a great go-to and again the size is perfect now i like the mini size just a little bit more but when i'm thinking of having like places to go and needing to have multiple items in my handbag the mini bag just doesn't work it's just too small it's perfect for like on the go days in the summer but if I'm going to have several different like skin products, lotions, um, hand sanitizers, I'm going to have some makeup in my purse. I'm going to throw my camera in there, my phone in there, my tripod. I need something bigger. This handbag is going to work a lot better for me in that case. Um, when I'm thinking about some of the fashion pieces that I've been looking at and clothing items I want for this fall season, everything is like neutral. I'm really pulling away from black. You totally can wear black with this particular handbag, so don't feel like you can't. But I'm just pulling back from black a little bit. I'm trying to. Obviously, there's just some things I love in black. Some things are going to look better in black. But I want to pull away from that. And this particular color handbag is going to help me do that. Obviously, I don't have a very large neutral handbag collection. I have this bag. I have my little YSL Mini Marmont. I have my new Fendi bag that my husband grabbed me and the next bag that I'm going to share kind of falls in that neutral category. But other than that, most of my bags are black. So when I'm trying to get away from wearing so much black, this is the type of bag that I need. So I imagine I'm going to carry this more. I'm so happy I didn't like sell it. And if my homegirl's watching this video, I'm glad you never came back and asked me about it because... I need it. I do need this bag. And again, I think it's going to get a lot more love this season. And if you all want to kind of check it and see if I'm pulling it out like I said I would, go ahead and follow me on my Instagram, Brown Girl Lux. So the next bag that we're going to talk about is one of my smaller handbags that I have from Gucci. This is the Gucci Dionysus wallet on chain. So obviously it's a wallet on chain, but we treat it as a handbag. This particular bag is a perfect go-to for fall. If you are a neutral girl, you're going to love this bag. One of my girlfriends recently got this for her uh, treat for her birthday. And she just was telling me how much like my videos helped her figure out what bag she should be adding next to her collection i think this bag is going to be great for her i also think my best friend who wears a ton of neutral or a ton of green i think this is going to be a great next bag for her as well if you all are thinking about this bag um there's been a couple increases but not much i think i got it for 12.50 it might be 14.50 now if you have been watching my videos and you've been thinking you want this bag but you didn't want to buy it when you saw it don't let no more price increases come. Save your money, get your coins together, and go ahead and grab it. Again, fall season, I like to be girly, but then I also have moments where I want to give off a little bit of an edge, a little bit of a grunge effect. This bag is perfect for that. You have this more like gunmetal silver, which I really love this. This is going to be a perfect combo with my new earrings that you all saw in the unboxing. This is going to be perfect to be paired together. I think this is an amazing handbag. I've had it for some time now. It has no signs of wear and tear. Someone asked me recently like, hey, um, you know, does it show, you know, marks or anything? I mean, literally, there is no marks of anything on this bag. And I have spilled a whole cup of coffee on this bag and there is not a mark so this canvas from gucci is very very durable i know a lot of people don't know they don't trust it the same as they trust louis vuitton's canvas but i'm here to say it's top tier as well um another thing i just want to call about this bag is that if you are someone that you know you're super minimal even in the fall season, this is going to be a bag that will be easy for you to use. Most people find that wallet on chains because of all the slots, it can be a little bit more like inconveniencing because you would almost do better not having all of this in the middle. But in my opinion, I can work with it either way. Now, if you want to give yourself some extra space, try to just use the card slots instead of a card holder. Instead of using a coin purse, use this little zipper pouch to put your coins in. Really just try to maximize your space with this because honestly, you can. You just have to put things in there accordingly. But this bag can do a lot for you. It definitely fits your phones. Um, I don't imagine any of the new phones not fitting. I think this is still a great size for most 
most people. And again, if you are minimal, grabbing something like this day to day is not going to be an issue for you. Overall, I just love the color. Almost everything I showed today, no everything, everything I've showed today goes with this shirt. So I'm wearing just a neutral like button down type of blouse and all of these bags I showed you all today work with this. So if you're a neutral girl and you needed to know which bag you needed this fall, I'm telling you right now, these are the five best options. Now, my best recommendation, I would say the most versatile bag, you're probably going to think that I'm wrong, but I'm going to say the most versatile option is going to be this one. Just because this can be carried on your shoulder, it can be carried crossbody, you can double up the strap, carry it in your hand, like top handle style almost. Um, the YSL bag is just so big, so I just feel like that can just kind of take away from the versatility of it. The Gucci bag, really you're only carrying on your shoulder or crossbody, so you only have two ways to carry it. The Palm Springs Mini, obviously that's a favorite for me, but the price point on that is almost, you know, not double, but times two almost. Well, yeah, it's, it's like one and a half, okay? So if you're thinking about what's the most affordable, and the most versatile of the options shared today, I definitely have to say that the Gucci Dionysus Walk is the best one. So, let me know in the comments if luxury handbag is in your collection for fall. I'm curious what your favorites are. For me, um, I would say from the collection share today, obviously the Palm Springs Mini because I just carry it all the time, every day. But if I had to pick a second one, it would definitely be the Dionysus Wallet on Chain. But I appreciate you all so much for watching this video. Please don't forget to comment down below and let me know what your fall luxury handbag is. If you have several that you'd like to rotate, let me know down in the comments. If you have any more fall related videos that you want to see, let me know down in the comments as well. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends. I'll see you all in my next one.